A Lusaka-based NGO is allegedly swindling and suspecting women out of their money collected as their contribution towards an empowerment program. This is in Lusaka's Munali constituency, where those who claim to have been swindled say they were asked to form groups and later contribute 50 kwacha each some two weeks ago. Meanwhile, non-governmental organization registration board chairperson Chanda Nonde says the NGO is not registered and he has since aged women to be wary of fake groupings. An empowerment program meant to benefit the vulnerable women has gone sour. A Lusaka-based NGO, which is supposedly meant to empower those who want, is allegedly claiming for payments in order to access the loans and other empowerment programs. The named NGO is alleged to have told those unsuspecting to form groups and access empowerment loans and other programs, aside from making 50 kwacha contributions. The victims recruited include those from Charleston, Kaunda Square, Kamanga and Obama. He came to recruit members, but he was not entertaining questions. The NGO is however not registered with the non-government organizations board which sits in the Ministry of Community Development. There is a lot of uh, illicit financing that is happening through the NGOs and uh, we are keeping an eye and uh, we want to assure every Zambian that we will not allow that the NGOs are used as tools of bringing in uh, money in the country to, to be channeled to things that are not building the nation. Meanwhile, Mnali Ward Councillor Sylvester Mlenga scored on women to hold forwarding their contributions until the NGO is investigated. What is coming out now is that uh, this particular person is demanding 50 quarts per individual from one of the members. So this is the reason why we have violated all those groupings which have been formed to ensure that they don't uh, pay any single way. Because it's not making sense uh, for one to pay to access empowerment. Efforts to get a comment from the NGO's coordinator proved futile as his phone went unanswered. This is despite promising to grant an interview a day before. Delfista Lungu, ZNBC News in Lusaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe.